Enter your username and password on the login page and click sign in. All test centres that you are associated with are listed here. Select the test centre that you wish to access and click the login button. Select ECDL Core from the product list. You are now in the Manage Classes screen. Test Centre Balance for ECDL products is located at the top of the screen. All classes are listed to the left of the screen. Select Create a class to create a new class. Give the class a name, choose the package that the students will be using, and then click Create Class. Next, select the class that you've just created. The class details will appear on the right. Click the Packages link and assign a minimum number of diagnostic and certification test units for each class member. Finally, click Update Package Units. Select the Candidates tab. There are no candidates in this class at present. Candidates are automatically added to the class using the self-registration procedure. In order to do this, we must add this class to the self-registration class list. To do this, click the self-reg link. Then click Include in self-reg drop-down. Candidates must now complete the self-registration. In order to do so, they must select ECDL Core from the drop-down list. Then they select the class they should be in. At this point, students enter their first name and surname, and then click Next. Their name will appear, which they are asked to confirm. They then enter their address and click Next. Following this, they can enter their gender and date of birth. Both are optional. At this point, they will be asked to claim their new free email address or use a personal email address. If they would like to pick a MyClick account, a suggested email address will appear on screen. Students should then enter a password. And finally answer two security questions. Registration is now complete. Next we click the Candidates tab. All candidates that have self-registered appear here under Candidate Status. To assign additional candidates we click Assign. Candidates who did not select a class when self-registering will appear here. By default all candidates are selected. Uncheck the checkbox beside Assign Candidate and individually select the candidates you wish to assign. Then click Assign Candidates. By clicking on Candidate Status, you can now view all candidates in this class. Next, we click on eLearning in order to enroll students for online learning. By default, all students are selected. Deselect any students who should not be enrolled for eLearning and click Submit to LMS. Finally, click Test to enrol students for online testing. At this point, it is possible to edit test credits for individual students. Leave the Auto-Enroll button ticked and finally click Submit to ATS.